Alrighty guys, another day of shooting and I have shortened my draw length after so many people saying shorten your draw length but I had a big thing about the draw length shorten because every time I shorten my draw length I had to start bending my elbow in. I felt like I was doing this every time I shortened my draw length. But everybody kept saying shorten that draw length, shorten that draw length. That's what got me thinking well, there must be something going on there if it's too long but I can't make it any shorter that's what got me thinking maybe my anchor points way too far back so I think that's been my problem I normally anchor with the two knuckles right at the back of the chin now I'm gonna just move them in a bit I've moved them down a little bit so I had to shorten the draw length to move the anchor point rather than shorten the draw length to move the front arm shorten the draw length to move the anchor point so today I'm going to shoot another Vegas, let's see if it makes any difference. And um, is that about it? I think that's about it, So, but it's totally changed everything. I had to move the peep sight, had to um, retune it a little bit. I haven't really tuned it much in, I need to retune it, but I'm just going to shoot it anyway. And uh, tell me how I'm looking, tell me if I'm looking any better, any worse. So I moved me. You see, I had it like right there on the tip of my jaw, and now I'm going to move it down to like there. Well, that's shortening the draw length. So now that I'm doing that, it does feel a little bit long, but we'll try it. We'll give it a go today and see how we go. So I've just done two ends to try and get my sights in. I think I'm sighted in. I think I'm ready to go. You see the whole kit and caboodle here. Alright, so let's get into it. Shorten draw length, anchor point change. Alright, first end down already. You're watching for this one. You ready for this one? Boom! Oh, quick detach on the camera now. Thanks for that tip. Definitely made it a bit easier. So it's. I can't believe I didn't think about that the whole time people were saying, move your move your short and your draw length, short and your draw length. Well, I thought about now and we're giving it a go now, so let's see how we go. So first lot, first end. I have XX10. Okay, let's get on the next one. Okay, second end. That was a low one. Alright, so lately I've got a bad habit of letting them go when I'm not on the target. I don't know what I'm doing there. First shot I let go when I was low. Second shot I let go when I was 
just off to the side, but I think I've scraped them both in just, just. Does that lighten up a bit? Oh, just touching the line and just a low one there. So it's 10 X 10, just. Okay, third end, make sure I let it go when I'm on. Don't start me shot process before I center in. Alright, this new anchor point, I think it's um, making me talk at just a fraction maybe. So the first two went right, and the second one I concentrate about not talking and she stayed back in the centre. So I've got 10, 10, 10. So I have to make sure that I don't talk it with this new anchor point. Okay, fourth end. Wind blew me off a little bit then. Okay, so first shot, the wind got me. Didn't really get me that bad, but it made me panic a little bit. Oh God, the wind's going, go! Freaked out. So there's my first nine, shocking. So I've got nine X, X. Okay, fifth end. Okay, that last shot, I kind of forgot about my anchor point, went back to the old one, but then I was like, readjust, readjust to the new one, get everything set, and man, it feels nice when I get that new anchor point set, so maybe that's the way to go now. It's been my problem the whole time. I have 
10, 10, X. Okay, six then. Definitely feels a lot nicer with that anchor point there. I'm feeling it in the front hand. I don't have as much in the front end. The front end's real dead now, which is what you want. Okay, so we have 10XX. Okay, seventh end. The further I go, the better this seems to feel. So maybe I'm onto something. Definitely feeling really nice now. Might be back, baby. I could be back. I could be back. X, X, X. Okay, eighth in, and I had to uh, change the targets because I was shooting the center out too much. Ooh, don't you like that? I do. I do a lot. Rush that one. It'll take me time, take me time. Absolutely blew the second one. I was getting too cocky, thinking, yeah, I've got this now. I'm pro. I'm going pro. I'll see you at Vegas. And then I go on bloody shooting iron. Just rushed it. Just getting a bit too excited. Thinking, yes, I'm back. And rushed it a little bit. And look, it's a weasel. Oh. How's that for a stinking weasel? Is that focusing in? Ah, uh, bugger. 
Okay, so we have X, nine, X. Okay, ninth end. Alright, so I think the first one might be out, I don't know, it just didn't feel right, something just felt a little bit off. I think I kicked it out to the right, but how far to the right, we'll soon find out. Oh, I think it's a weasel. Dirty, stinking weasel again. So I've got 9XX. Okay, 10th and last end, just relax, pull through the shots, pull through the shots. All right, I think I stuffed that last one up. I knew I was last arrow, if I got it into a 10, it would equal a PB. The best I've ever shot in a Vegas round is uh, 97, 297 dropping three. And that last arrow, I was like, I oh, just get it in, get a PB, get an equal to PB. It's been so long since you got a good score. And I think I slipped it out. Oh, no, I got it, I got it, I got it. <laughs> Got X ten ten, which means I dropped three, which is killing it for the way I've been shooting lately. So I think this anchor point has really made a big difference. So I'm absolutely stoked with that. Kind of got me hunger back a bit for archery because I was kind of getting into a bit of a slump there. Go, oh, go! I'm not getting any better. Nothing's happening. Oh my god. Then, oh, drama's going on everywhere, so I just didn't want to really shoot much, but changing that, and it feels so much better, feels like I'm shooting good again. So I think I might start making a few more videos for you. So expect a few more videos, stay tuned, I'll start trying to pump them out daily. Let us know if you want us to pump them out daily again. All right, guys, so if you liked the video, make sure you hit the like button for us, hit the subscribe button, hit all the other buttons there is, and I'll see you soon for another video.